Speaking to the media in Port Moresby this afternoon, President Momi said his government sees the move as interference in Bougainville affairs. The evil involved in this aspect of the Rio Tinto decision is that it involves completely unwarranted interference in the politics of Bougainville. All issues about the Panguna mine are deeply sensitive for Bougainvilleans. He said this unprincipled move by Rio Tinto is a reminder of what sparked the Bougainville crisis and shows arrogance by Rio Tinto. Rio has transferred its 53% majority to a trust on the basis that the shares are offered to the ABG and the national government. They propose that 36.4% should go to the ABG and 17.4% to the national government. When the 17.4% national government shares are added to the existing national government minority shareholding, the ABG and the national government would be equal minority shareholders, each owning 36.4%. However, he says it provides an opportunity for PNG and the ABG to negotiate an arrangement that is mutually benefiting. The opportunity for a positive outcome arises if the national government is prepared not to take up the transfer of Rio shares in BCL that is now on offer through the Rio Tinto appointed trustee. If it refused the shares, then they would be offered to, for transfer to the ABG in two months. The ABG would then be able to become the 53.8% owner of BCL. The national government could continue to be the main minority shareholder with its existing 19% shareholding. An arrangement, he says, that will have far-reaching consequences. It would go a very long way to consolidating change in attitudes of Bougainvilleans to the national government. Sarah Aupong, National MTV News.